A big hello to all my wonderful champions out there. I hope you are doing great, my dear children. So yes, you have completed one level of your thing that is uh, giving the examination. Now you might be waiting for your result and then comes option entry, counselling and this and that. And my dear children, just suppose your exam went well, you have nice score but you have not applied for the great college. Then what will happen? The next four years, doomed. Do we want that? No. We want the best college for ourselves, right? Because you have worked really hard for it. And that is why I am here. I'm going to talk about MSRIT today. Okay, so I have completed almost three colleges already. The review for that. Now I am here where I'll be talking about how you can get into MSRIT. Is it only via KCT or do you have Comet K as well? And also, well, I'll tell you for children who are in Comet K background, you do not, uh, let's say, you do not have to wait patiently. Yes, you can get into MSRIT via Comet K. I'll be talking about the cutoff, which was there for the year 2024. And seat matrix is just the same as 2024. Okay, when we get the new seat matrix, we will be making a separate video on that as well. Please do not worry about anything. I'll be talking about the placement rates that I got from their official website. Yeah, and the hostel facilities that they have and what? Mm. And the fees, okay, and the fees which is there. So while I was going through the profile, I saw certain scholarship options as well. If possible, we will be making a video on that also. Okay, we'll see through it. We need a genuine information for that. And after getting that, only we can make a video. So please stay tuned for that. Yes, so let's get into MSRIT College. Overview of the college, its name is Ramaya Institute of Technology. Initially, it was known as MS Ramaya Institute of Technology, MSRIT. Yeah, year of establishment is 1962. Location is MSR Nagar, Bengaluru. And also affiliation, Vishweshraya Technological University. Okay, now. Talking about the fees, that is one very important thing. So in the fees, there is a clash, little clash, but I'll tell you the thing, okay? So for KCAT, generally we say the, uh, the what's a price went up to, the fees went up to rupees 1,7495 the previous year. Now, uh, if you have not seen any other college review videos, I'll tell you that also. Over here, you, the KCET, okay, the KEA, basically they have put down a thing like this. That is the fee structure, okay? So general merit category 2, 2A, B, 2A, 2B category or SNQ category, SCST category, category 1 where annual income is up to 2.5 lakhs. For them, the fees is all different. And depending on the college you're getting into, that is also very, very different. So the highest fees has been meant for type 2 unaided colleges, including minority and unaided courses in aided colleges, which has been rupees 1,15,956. This is according to KEA. Okay. So which is why I wrote the fees, which is mentioned over here, that is 1,7495. Okay. This is for KCAT in this was for the KCAT in the previous year. Talking about Comet K, it was rupees 2,81,477. And this is for all the courses. Amma, just a second. For all the courses starting from artificial intelligence to what mechanical engineering, my dear children. For Comet K, it's okay. For Comet K, it's okay. Now, what I saw in their website is something different. Okay. So, I went to their website for checking the fee and then I found for CET, SNQ is 51,011, uh, sorry, 51,110. For uh, Karnataka students, this is rupees uh, 1,27,245. Non-Karnataka students is 1,28,745 via KCET. Now, for Comet K or management for here, you do not have anything. Here it is 3,12,000. 587. Okay, so I am I'm assuming that this is the highest that it can go via Comet K and this is what they have already put down in the Comet K website as well as in the KEA website. Okay, so this data is from the college website, but obviously colleges cannot have their own fees and things like that, which is why I think they might have followed this itself. They might have just given a provisional fee method, but you can please go ahead and ask your fellow, let's say friends who are there already in this particular college about the fees as well, just to have a confirmation. So I'm here to give you genuine information rather than anything that that is there in their website, my dear children. So please have a could check with all your friends who are out there okay but this is a tentative idea of things and as i told to told you sorry told you there are so many scholarship options as well as post metric things uh, that scholarship and things like that if i can i'll definitely make a video on it as well so don't worry about anything okay now going ahead with 
the institutional ranking framework national institution ranking framework that is nirf ranking the college ranking is 75 which is pretty good so in india within the top 100 colleges comes this particular msrit college on the 75th position if we talk about the university ranking that is vishweshwaraya technological university again it is also on 75th position which is not pretty bad now nirf ranking is done on the basis of the faculty qualities the number of admissions being taken and this and that lot of things okay so that is there now the most important thing the cutoff okay the most important thing is the cutoff now remember always for kcat the code will be different for comet k the code will be different college code so it is e006 over here for kcat for comet k it's e007 sorry e077 the seat matrix which was there available in the previous year was this the cutoff which meant after second round extension okay st extended second round my dear children it was this Okay, so as you can see, the highest cutoff has been meant for computer science and engineering, which is 2012. Okay, so if you are getting a rank below this only, you will be getting into this particular course in MSRIT. Similarly, if you are giving Comet K also, your rank should have been 1585 the previous year. I think here it in got increased because as, I, as you know, in case here there were so many related portions that came up the previous year, which is why they might have increased a bit. But my dear children, this year it can be little more tougher. So please have that in your head. Okay. Why is all this video important? Because I want you to make an option list. Okay. You should be knowing which are the colleges that probably you can get into. Make a list of it because you will need it in option entry round. Okay. Now, for all the other courses, as you can see over here, Artificial Intelligence and Data Science, it is 4,390. Biotechnology, it is 16,766. Chemical Engineering, it is 29,392. Civil Engineering, 39,924 and things like that. For Comet K and KCET. Going ahead, there are other courses as well. In Computer Science itself, you have different, different sources. One is Computer Science and Engineering. Then you have Artificial Intelligence and Machine Learning, AML. Yeah. And then you have Cyber Security. And apart from that, there is Electrical and Electronics Engineering and so many things. Information Science and Engineering, my dear children. So here the cutoff has been 3712 and there it has been 3115. All of them are very important courses, right? Now, for Industrial Engineering and Management, the cutoff was pretty low it was 55,606 okay and for comet kit has been 93,650 that is pretty low cutoff so probably if you are in this particular range you can get into this particular course as well okay so this is all about msrit and over here i saw one more extra thing that is medical electronics that is a usual field that i did not see anywhere else yes but the scope of it we have to check so this is about the cutoff now i'll show you a difference between okay the previous year and this year so when we saw the previous year cutoff that is 2023 previous to previous year okay so it was uh, 1859 that is the highest cutoff it was for cs okay computer science and it was 6 64430 over here as i told you it increased a bit they loosened up a bit but this time it can come again back to this particular range itself yeah and 55606 was the highest limit so basically if you are in this particular range you will be getting into this particular college so there's a change but we can expect it to come back over here as the exam was not that tough if we say so yes okay same goes with comet k as well now there is a cutoff for all the different quotas so i took the cutoff from general merit category for different different quota you would be having different different things if you want this pdf link you can let us know in the comment section we can provide you the link so what you have to do is you have to put down the number okay you have to put down the number e006 is for kct right when you put down that control f and you put this number you will be able to see this particular chart over here and then depending on your category 1g 2ag whatever category you fall into you can see the cutoff for each course so this is the course and this is the cutoff that is being mentioned over here okay so initially i said that you can take a snip of it but i know it's difficult for you so make sure you can do this okay and children i hope we are helping you if we are helping you we also need your support please like the video please share it with your friends and do let us know what help do you want more from us we are here to help you out with that now the placement is that is the most important data right so according to them this is a direct snip from their website 358 companies have visited 1892 job offers are there 50 lpa has been the highest package in the year 2024 okay and the average package was 7.6 lpa and they they said that there is 95 percent placement percentage and for 2025 it's going on but can we blindly trust this mm -hmm. 
as their website obviously they will be promoting them okay so what we have to do we have to believe in the word of mouth also okay so please go and talk to your friends who are there ask them uh, whether the recruitment process is smooth and which is the field where you get most recruitment for example someone has taken civil engineering your uh, what say the cut off because the cut off is really easy to get into you chose civil engineering but do you get placed if you take civil engineering all these things you have to keep your keep in mind you get it so make sure or you are doing that from now itself which is why we are putting the video now so that you have enough time before counseling to take an informed decision my dear children we will be redoing the video with the updated seed matrix and everything out there but as of now you have to look forward to this works chalo next thing so this is also given 2024 from 2020 to 2024 the trend which is there so 0.6 lakh it was 0 to 6 lakh sorry it was 623 number of offers Okay, if you see fourteen lakhs and above in the year two thousand twenty-four, the number of companies visited was forty-three, and uh, the number of offers made were one eighty-four, which gave fourteen lakhs and above. Okay, so this is a trend. Again, I got the snip from their official website itself. Now, going ahead. hostel facilities since i could not get the fees for hostel i have put down the names of the people and their phone numbers i do not know should i be doing this or not but i thought it will be a big help to you please do not call them uh, for no reason only if you are planning to get into this particular college if you think that your marks are pretty good for getting into this college then only please call them otherwise please do not disturb any of the human beings out there remember you are also a human being please treat others also as humans yes so this is the thing this is the help that i could do for you and if at all something comes up if they update their brochure my dear children mostly towards counseling only they all will be updating their brochure and things like that if something come we we, are, we could come out we come across something we'll definitely make you know about that as well works yes so i think that's all that sums up everything about msriit please do your research there are, i already did a uh, what's the video for rvc for bms as well as pes ring road campus and now it's msriit all of it go through it once more go to their official website see what all falls in your category which all cause course is something that you probably can get into write it down somewhere i know it's a process with a bit of headache but you have to take this headache for preventing any future headaches right so make sure you do that and for uh, knowing about all the information you have to subscribe to our channel and also like the video and share it with your friends and if you have any 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 query regarding anything put it down in the comment section only to the queries that i can help you with okay so please do that and do let me know after watching the video if you feel that you are ready to take an informed decision as i always say comment down that i am going to take an informed decision this year please do that i'll be really really happy if you put it down because i'll get to know that you saw until here yes so that's all please take care of yourself good health and good luck